everyone welcome to another episode of whiskey and crypto really excited today bitcoin broke ten thousand again so i have some of course you see it on the screen some woodford reserve this is my go-to this is probably my favorite bourbon whiskey it's great i love the flavor it has tons of flavors to it it's got just vanilla caramel i mean you can see the, the little flavor chart it's got the wood the almond the pecan and i swear you can smell just about all of it in there like pepper clove cinnamon coffee tobacco nutmeg mint it's even got some really flavors to it you know, cranberry apple pear peach and i think it really all depends on your taste buds at the end of the day but I tell you what, with Bitcoin hitting 10K again, I think anything would taste good on the taste buds right now. I think what we're gonna see in 2018 is just a mass adoption of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. You have to be careful out there because there are a lot of scam currencies. So you wanna stick with some of the, the top dogs like Ethereum, Bitcoin, Woodford Reserve, it's so great. I love that I made this channel because it's going to give me all kinds of new experiences as far as trying out new whiskeys. And if you like whiskey and you like crypto, this is your place. It's 90.4 proof. It's 45.2% alcohol by volume. It's just a wonderful, wonderful drink. And this would go really well with like orange peel or, you know, even maybe some mint would be really good in here. Up. It's pretty good just the way it is. We're gonna go to uh, coin market cap that Bitcoin is trading at $10,258. Still trending up, gone up 7% in the last 24 hours. A lot of the cryptos right now are green, they're moving up. Pretty good gains in there. You know, there are a few losses here and there. Bitcoin and crypto is gonna be around for a very long time and Mark my words, as soon as the American people get their money in it, this market is going to explode. It is simply going to take off. I originally intended out making a video about fashion affiliate links, but I'm going to wait and do that in a whole entirely separate video. I mean, I figured Bitcoin hitting 10K deserved a little bit of celebration, and I need to add some content to my channel because I'm really trying to get the ball rolling here. I'm really excited about crypto. <clears throat> In my last video, I showed you my mining rig. If you haven't seen that, you might want to watch my last video. And, you know, I'm just getting really excited, really pumped up. It's just a great time to be getting involved with this. And if you haven't already, you need to at least put a couple hundred dollars in there. You know, if you can't afford a couple hundred dollars, then don't do it. But by all means, if you can get a couple hundred dollars in there, a couple thousand dollars into the market, even if it's not in Bitcoin, if it's in other currencies like you know maybe some of the top 10 i would definitely do that make sure you do your research before you do it make sure that you know you scour youtube for all the videos on the coin that you're interested in purchasing and holding being in the computer business and seeing what's going on in the market right now i have a feeling that bitcoin is gonna just it's gonna shoot right back up to twenty thousand in no time you know it might take a month but we might have another dip before we get to twenty thousand but i think it's gonna happen i really sincerely think that it's gonna happen because bitcoin is limited there's a limited amount and as soon as people buy it up and people in america start cashing on it's gonna go crazy and as soon as these financial institutions and you know large corporations start buying into the cryptocurrency man it, you know people like me that have gotten in now are gonna have it made in the shade and i was actually telling a friend of mine uh, today that i wish i gotten into it two years ago because i'd probably be buying a brand new boat by now i mean like a nice boat and actually i'm selling my boat just so i can put more money back into the market right now that's how confident i am remember don't put more into it than what you can afford to lose I and mean, that's the most important key if it makes you feel comfortable put a little bit in the stock market Put a little bit into crypto, put a little bit into real gold. I mean, diversify your portfolio. You know, I mean, if you're gonna save money or you're gonna invest, 
spread it out. I mean, don't try to put it all in the crypto thinking that you're going to get rich quick because there's no getting rich quick in this world. It's just a, a really exciting time to be in the market. I, I'm really pumped up about this channel and I'm really pumped up about having a diversified portfolio that's making me money. My portfolio is still down because I got in in January, which is a really, really bad time to get in because it was at the 1st of January when I got it in. It was at an all-time high, and I was actually buying stuff as it was still dropping. And so I'm still at a negative on my portfolio, but uh, a friend of mine got in this past week on Monday, and he's up 20% on his. And could you just imagine 20% on $100,000? I mean, that's like $20,000 in just a few days. But anyways, that's for risk and reward i mean if you don't have a hundred thousand dollars to put in there don't put a hundred thousand dollars in there put however much you can afford half of however much you can afford because i'm just telling you guys put something in there because I, I honestly believe and i wouldn't be making a youtube channel about this if i didn't think that you would double triple quadruple your money and I think that you could pretty much pick any coin that's in the top 20. Uh, I wouldn't go for Tether, but uh, that's just my personal opinion. But anything else, I think the top 19 right now that you see on this page of mine, any of these right now, the top 19, if you pick one of these, you could double, quadru quadruple your money in the year. Plus, I'm long-term holding. I'm buying the hold. And as soon as I get to a point where I feel uncomfortable holding, which hopefully will be sometime in 2019, I'm going to cash out on a dip. And that's long-term trading. So hopefully the tax implications won't be that bad. And I appreciate you guys tuning in. And remember, I will be coming out with new videos every few days. I really have some uh, videos I want to make about some scams going on right now with affiliate links and with, with uh, Minergate. I mentioned that in my last video, and I fully intend to make that video happen. This minor gate has really pissed me off. Anyways, appreciate you guys watching. As always, tune in to the next one.